Fortnite Season 4 Chapter 5 is giving us more free items than ever before, and I'm gonna show you guys how to get every single one of them, and if you're lucky, you could even get something from the item shop, because I am still gifting five subscribers every single day who drop a like, turn on all notifications, and leave a comment with their epic ID. Thank you guys for all the support, and a special thank you to everyone taking two seconds to type Doom in their Fortnite item shop when they log on. It really means the world to me. So free reward number one is actually a surprise for my subscribers who have notifications on because here are three codes you can put in at fortnite.com slash redeem one of them is for the rebirth harley quinn skin another is for the catwoman pickaxe and the third one is one of the marvel zero war cosmetics i'm not sure which one it is exactly these codes can only be used once so if it didn't work for you that means someone redeemed it before you i'm not gonna do this every video since i'm already sending gifts but maybe i'll do it like once a week or something so for free reward number two we have the yeetus hammer and i think this free reward has kind of gone under the radar because everyone has been focused on the free catalina skin obviously that showed up in everybody's game but to get this pickaxe which you can use in fortnite you actually have to play fall guys on mobile the challenge is super easy i think you only have to play like five games the only bad thing is is that you can only play fall guys on mobile on an android device if you're in the united United States if you're in Europe you can actually get it on your iPhone so that's pretty good so I think most of you guys should be able to do this without any problems because I think just about everyone knows someone at least with a mobile phone they could log in with the only problem is for the United States players that don't have an Android device so if that's the case you're probably gonna have to find a friend or family member that does have an Android that you can borrow I mean you're probably gonna need it anyway for free reward number three because we have the whole Catalina skin set there was a workaround where you could like play a creative 1.0 map and you would be able to unlock it on any platform however they already did patch that so if you didn't get this skin set already then you're gonna have to actually play it on mobile now and like i said it's probably worth it because even the back bling is really cool the pickaxes are unique and the challenges are just to earn xp so it should be pretty easy and believe it or not free reward number four is actually even easier because if you played fortnite on a samsung device from December 3rd of 2022 all the way to August 16th of 2024 this year, you will earn the Space Touch Serenity set just by logging into your Samsung device once more. So it says you have until September 15th to log in and just get this skin immediately. However, I haven't seen people receiving it yet, so I'm not sure technically which day it's gonna start going out to people. But yeah, if you qualify for this, you really lucked out. And I know there's gonna be a lot of us that didn't use a Samsung device in that time but don't worry if you really want it all these skins end up coming to the item shop anyway so you will have a chance to purchase it at least and speaking of galaxy skins it turns out for free reward number five every single one of you guys will be able to get a free galaxy reward however this time it's for fortnite's seventh birthday quest so yeah, we know it's galaxy themed because there's already a galaxy themed cake with the number seven as a prop in the files already. And then there's also a galaxy themed flare gun. But not only that, there's also gonna be a galaxy battle bus and a balloon medallion that will give you a balloon every time you jump. So yeah, that should be a pretty cool event. Last year for Fortnite's sixth birthday, we got those quests on September 19th. So you can expect it around that time. And for 2023, they gave us a free back bling. So I imagine we'll get a galaxy back bling or a galaxy birthday cake back bling that is and then we also got a pickaxe as well as a spray so honestly a galaxy birthday cake pickaxe may be the best reward out of all of them and that's something we definitely have to look forward to because those challenges are always super easy to complete and technically they become pretty rare cosmetics because they never return to the game again but next up for free reward number six we have a super easy one that i'm sure a lot of you guys have already done but just in case you haven't all you have to do is log into your Epic Games account online. Then just go to your account settings. I'll put a link in the description just in case, but it's pretty easy to find. Just go to your account settings. And at the very top, there should be a section that says email preferences. And you just have to scroll all the way down to the bottom and there'll be a section that says survey. It says share your thoughts with Epic Games by taking surveys. So you just check that, click save changes. And that's literally it. Within 24 hours, you should get the Sir Burr backlink 
before completely free. I don't believe there's a deadline for when you need to do this. So don't worry too much, but definitely do it before you forget. Now for free reward number seven, this may be for people who are living under a rock like me, but maybe you came back to season four, chapter five after not playing for a while. And well, you probably don't know about this either because if you go to the item shop and then go to the menu on the side and scroll all the way down so you can skip down to the special offers and bundles, you can see there's actually a zero dollar bundle and this will allow you to unlock challenges to get the trailblazer tie outfit for completely free just by doing some challenges in lego fortnite and then not only can you get that skin for free but if you go to your account settings again go to your connected accounts and connect a lego account to your epic account which if you didn't know you can just make a lego account really quickly it's free doesn't cost you any money or anything but yeah once you do that and then you start up your game again you will instantly get the explorer emily skin for completely free as well as her lego version and a back bling so yeah it is that easy now for number eight i think i have some more rewards that people are overlooking because i didn't realize these quests don't show up unless you have fortnite festival selected and well since it doesn't look like very many people play fortnite festival i don't think a lot of you guys know about this but a new festival pass just came out and there are some completely free rewards you can get without paying anything so there's a loading screen banner icon jam tracks a guitar which i'm not sure if that turned into a pickaxe or a backlink or not but it says it's usable in battle royale and then you even have a pretty cool emote called heads up where you're playing a guitar behind your head and everything so if you like that emote you can literally earn this in fortnite festival for completely free and then like i was saying before there's also quests that only show up if you have fortnite festival highlighted so if you go down to the wristband quests you'll see there's an emote reward here as well as uh some sort of like mic stand which I i'm guessing might be a pickaxe i'm not sure and you can't preview the emote in game which is kind of weird but it's a different emote than the one that's in the festival pass this one's called miked up moves so this is a pretty cool emote as well and then there's also some ramp it up quests which include like a loading screen a banner icon and emoticon or emoji so yeah just wanted to let you guys know about that in case maybe you wanted some of those emotes or something but now for number nine it really looks like fortnite's going all out with competitive this season because there are so many free rewards that we can unlock coming up this week so basically they're having like a special event called fortnite's champions road which is happening through august 21st which is wednesday through september 29th there will be special quests that appear in game on august 21st and it looks like some of the challenges are just going to be like eliminate players survive storm circles and even some tougher ones like win a victory royale so yeah you guys are gonna have to start practicing and going try hard because basically you're going to be able to do these quests by participating in any of the many tournaments we have coming up so yeah if you guys want to see for yourselves you can go to the compete tab now and see that the first one is the champion kyra and cosmic in infinity fncs cup which is happening on august 21st the first day that this event is happening so if you select it you can even see the prizes and rewards for yourselves so getting in the top 1000 you'll actually get two free skins as well as a bunch of other stuff like a back bling and pickaxe and rap and stuff so yeah that is pretty crazy on its own but then you see in the days after that like literally the very next day we have a champion stashed fncs cup which gives you that skin and the whole set for free if you place top 1000 and then you have the champion champion siren cup the next day then the champion spark plug cup and then finally the champion kuno and renzo the champion fncs cup to finish off the week so this will obviously be the best one because this skin is brand new. It's an FNCS version of a Battle Pass skin. And if you see, they're actually going to give you the Axe of Champions pickaxe as well as part of the rewards. So that is absolutely crazy because you literally had to win FNCS, like the actual tournament, first place to get that pickaxe before. And I believe it's even coming to the item shop later. So that'll be pretty crazy. I think a lot of people will want that. So we know the tryhards are going to have an absolute blast this week, but it doesn't even end there because there's going to be a playstation cypher pk cup to get his skin and whole set that will be happening the next week after which will be august 31st and september 1st but obviously you'll have to be on playstation to do that and then there's going to be a ton of like solo cash cups even a reload squads victory cash cup and some other stuff as you guys see here so yeah there will be plenty of opportunities for you guys to do those challenges but like i said you really need to start practicing like today or eight 
ASAP by the time you guys are seeing this video because there are two cosmetic rewards just for doing those challenges or quests that are coming up. We've got the Tracker's Rally Back Bling and the Vanguard's Charge Emote. So yeah, those are the two rewards that you will be guaranteed to get if you actually put in the time. And yeah, it looks like that Axe of Champions will be coming to the item shop on September 4th. And I guess it turns out they're actually gonna make a third version, which will actually work like how it used to, where only the FNCS champions will have it. So I guess that's still pretty cool. And then whenever that FNCS championship does happen, we'll be able to earn drops by watching it once again, like how you can watch it in that creative map, you know, to earn them. But this time it doesn't look like the drops are very good, if I'm being honest. There's two emoticons and two sprays. So yeah, I guess this time around, they really want us to play and just not just watch the drops for the good stuff. And well, if you're on the fence about whether or not you really want to try for that, it turns out there are even more competitive or sweaty rewards to go for because there's some brand new rank rewards this season. And we can see the main ones are the Vanguard Star and the Perfection Pickaxe, which looks super cool. But to get that, you're gonna have to complete all the ranked quests. So as you guys can see, I guess it's not too hard. There's a lot of just survive storm circles, or that's pretty much it, I guess. So yeah, at the very least, you could start doing these and then figure out whether or not you actually want to sweat for those other challenges in the actual tournaments and stuff. Because it turns out there's also a ranked umbrella, which apparently you just have to play a ranked cup and get 50 points. So yeah, you also have that free reward. And then on top of that, this would also help contribute towards your survival medals quest line, which will allow you to get the different variants of the prize, the llama back bling. So yeah, at least you'll be gaining progress for a lot of different stuff at the same time if you decide to kind of sweat it out a bit. And well, if you're not a sweat at all, I have some good news because it is going to be super easy to get the Latvarian tactical grunt skin. It is going to be one of Dr. Doom's special rewards on the second page and well it turns out that you may not even need the battle pass for this reward either there's gonna be a couple of the dr doom rewards that don't require you to actually have the battle pass so even though i'm sure most of you guys probably have it this is still pretty cool because it might be like a completely free skin and believe it or not there is another free skin coming called elite archetype which is supposed to be one of the new playstation plus rewards so unfortunately you're gonna need to access to a playstation in order to get this but hey just thought i would keep you guys updated on that and finally for the last free rewards of the video this one's a little bit more of a mystery because we'll have to wait for the iron man update to actually drop before we know what these iron man related free rewards actually are leakers have found some traces of what the quest lines could be but we're not going to know most of the actual content in the update until that update is finally released i know this iron man update is going to be absolutely crazy though so i can't wait let me know what you guys would like to see as an iron man reward drop a like if you haven't already and i will see you guys soon with another video